And then there's backyard racing at the Madhouse. Bowman Gray, our photographer, Daniel Cruz, brings us tonight's sights and sounds from Winston-Salem. Celebrating our nation's independence. It's the theme of the night at Bowman Gray Stadium. The street stock's going to start us off. Brian Wall out in front. Lap one, Fletcher Wally's going to stir up dust. Lap 18, Brad Smith's going to spin. Lap 19, Jasper Sumner and Jeremiah Salonis are going to get together. Green flag flies. Zach Linville's going to spin, but no caution. Brian Wall will take on his first win of 2016. Twin 25s for the Modifieds. First race of the night, Jason Myers and Tim Brown out in front. 25 laps goes by quick when you're having fun. Caution free. Jason Myers says thank you, and he will take home his sixth career Bowman Gray victory. Good. Our other win came to the second 25 lap. It's not quite the same feeling, but I tell you, come over here and sit on the pole, lead every lap and win the race. You can't ask for much more than that. Big race of the night, 60 laps for the sportsman division. Lap 36, Zach Orr says, eat my dust, boys and girls, after spinning on the back stretch. Lap 39, Tiger Tommy Neal is going to make some friends. Lap 41, Billy Gregg is going to get spun by David Adams, and a big crash will ensue. Everyone is okay. Kevin Neal is going to hold on to that first place position and call it a win. Two weeks in a row. Uh, we've been working at it all year, and we finally got it right where we need to be. The car was giving up at the end, and I just had to wheel it hard as I could, and luckily it came out. Remember, boys and girls, no racing next week at Bowman Gray. Celebrate our great nation's independence. We'll see you back July 9th. At Bowman Gray Stadium, I'm Daniel Cruz, WXII 12 Sports. All right, and Randy Butner won the second modified race of the night. This is his first win since May of 2013. All right, that'll do.